everyone. Now today we are going to do a experiment and I will show you that the water displacement method that is used to find the volume of the uh, irregular, uh, irregular objects. So let's start the video. Our experiment we need three things and we can do it at our home too. Now at first we need a measuring cylinder i don't have a measuring cylinder so i make a line here and 10 cc 20 cc 30 cc and 40 cc now i'm gonna do and our irregular shape is this one you can see it is our irregular shape now we need some water okay let's start now we'll put some water in it okay we are gonna put some water in it oh it's more so that we are gonna to throw it little how much it is needed now i think it is now you can see that it is 20 cc. Yes. Now I will do that. I will put this stone inside it. Now we will know that now it is 20 cc. Now I will put this stone then how much it is. Let's try this one. 1, 2 and 3. 4. You can see this stone is taking this much part of this water and the water rises up. And this is only called the displacement method in 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 the in the standard form there is some pipe in there attached with another vessel now when the stone is put on the glass, the water goes through the pipe into another vessel. So that I don't have this um, thing so that I showed you how the water rises up with this stone. Now we can simply say that this stone is covering this much part of the water. And thank you for seeing the video. Now I am going to tell you the conclusion of the video now. There is um, there is 5 cc difference when we put the stone inside the um, jar then the 5 cc it increases. Now we are going to do that there was 20 uh, cc means um, 25 it became 25 now we're gonna minus it and the answer will be our the volume of the irregular object now when you minus 20 minus 25 there will be 5 cc now that 5 cc is is our answer and thank you for watching the video please like share and subscribe and don't forget to click that uh, bell notification into all and what you liked and what you disliked please write in the comment section